Intruder! Get her! Got someone Whatever you here. do, don't die now. I was hoping I was able to see his house. I can see anything. By my card. I, I, I try to exactly this. The sun's rays. Uh. That hurt. Uh. Uh. Would you just die? Let's yeah. let's, let's die exactly. out with them what the point of Artemis was I made it clear I wasn't on board for a global zoo we haven't exactly proved ourselves to be great custodians in the past few thousand years so the idea of a reconstituted biosphere well it's horrifying isn't it a complete horror show we have no right to take a best guess at this stuff but the alternative nothingness for there to have been all this, and then... nothing. And with Charles Ronson running the show, I respect him. He's got a passion to him. He's hot-blooded. So I said I'll do it. I'll put my all into this, literally. When the project is done, I'll take the medical option, thank you. Counselor said I might change my mind. I told him that he didn't know me very well then. For life's sake, I'll do the dirty work. But I want no part of this pathetic, attenuated future on offer. I'm an outdoors man. Never did like the feel of solid state lighting on my skin. And a wee bit of a claustrophobe, anyway. <laughs> I can relate to that. It would be a real issue for me as well. It got better over the years. Still a bit of a clo cla claustro claustrophobic here. Uh, wait, this is where half the goes, so this is where I go. Hello, dead person. Let me loot you. Zero Dawn. It is art, in a way. An expression on the grandest scale. But there is so much unfairness. Why was I chosen? Was it decided by committee? By algorithm? My family will be saved because I happen to graduate in art history? Is this right? Dr. Souve? Christina Souve? Yes. I met a man, another historian. His fields are Bauhaus and the new materialists. But he once attended one of my talks. Another unfair chance. Of all the many people in the auditorium, that we should both be here now? And yet, I feel more accepting of my fate. No, it is not fair, not at all. But for the sake of my family, for the sake of art. Art is alive. It must be able to speak from beyond history and echo in the future, not perish into oblivion. This opportunity, I must do this. This is so sad. First of all, hi, real Savaloy. Splendid you city, you're gonna see, I hope you're doing good. Like, considering whatever happened to this knowledge archives, apparently the people of the future weren't able to find it. So, so, the whole idea worked, like, Zero Dawn. Worked, but everything she did, like, like, making sure the people of the future will know art from, from the past. 
I mean, at least, I, I don't know what happens in the end. Will we find these archives again? I don't know. I ask myself this question. I don't want any answers. I can't remember. I, I hope, because she did her part, that it didn't matter at all in the end. Even though the project itself Stocking worked. Up. Uh, that's frustrating. No one tell her. She sounded nice. Okay, there was nothing here. There, to the left. Yeah, I can see it now. I can see it very clearly now. Now, those lame FBI black hats at Mockingbird back in oh, the no, day... Oh no, not Travis. I don't like Travis. I enjoyed schooling them. Travis is But maybe I went in too hard on this poor oh. counselor. She was cute, and just going down a checklist after all. Couldn't expect her to see how ridiculous Zero D's ambitions are. God's own budget thrown at a kid playing with a hologram sculptor? Palms up, honey. I'm just calling it like it is. Hey, look, Mom, I'm making nature. Now, if nature is so important, why not let nature take its course? Extinction? That's natural. Zero dawn and no ma'am, that ain't. Heck, it's so unnatural it'd be called an abomination back home, and you know it. That's why you're hiding it. Meanwhile, my little honey of a counselor, she's munching the inside of her cheek. Bad habit. She chewed one of her nails, too. Just one. Not your day, was it, little sweet pea? Jesus Saw her Christ. quota slipping away. Can someone... Said, I, I hope she died of worry. to decline the assignment, Mr. Way. Tate. <laughs> you kidding me? 18 months hard labor in exchange for 30 years lounging around Elysium watching porn? <laughs> Sign me up. I think I made up my mind Trevor State is the worst character on the whole game. Hey, sorry, Sevalor, you asked me a question. I'm doing fine. Except, that, like, like I did better. Is there another route? 30 seconds ago before. before I had to listen to Trevor. Just need my focus. Now I feel a little sick to my stomach, but I'm still doing fine. Uh, what? Yeah, focus, give me a sec. I'm, I'm looting. I don't need my focus for that. I mean, I know where I have to go restore the power. What, what, what do you want to focus? I know where I have to go. Here we go. Well, that looks fun. Another one of these. Uh, Need to find the right configuration. Yeah, yeah. Hey, I'm done with Brett's incompetence, okay? Somehow, he managed to install an H emitter node backwards. Everything's in reverse. I don't get paid to clean up Brett's messes. If you want it fixed, send him up to storage for a new emitter, not me. Parker out. Sorry, it wasn't. Was this important? It was such a short message. He's very Christ, but honestly, quite funny. No, he's not. No, no, Travis is just annoying. Uh, Connexer is secure encryption port with holographic display. Data shows required settings for nearby hello logs. Error detected. Setting transport. I, I have no idea what you want. There's a part missing. Maybe there's a storage area nearby. Okay. Oh yeah, now we see it. Storage area nearby, like around here? That looks close. It's probably the door I want to open. Mm -hmm. Never mind then. Okay, it could turn you around, but it sounded like I needed the, 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 the other part first. Unfortunately, there's no storage area. Hey, Are you. I'm done with Brett's incompetence, okay? Somehow, he managed to install an H emitter node backwards. Everything's in reverse. I don't get paid to clean up Brett's messes. If you want it fixed, send him up to storage for a new emitter, not me. Parker out. Okay, everything's in reverse. This is actually valid information. Yert, this is still broken. I don't know where another one is. Do I have to go a little further back? Storage room? Is this storage room? Okay, I don't, I, I don't think this, this doesn't feel right. Where you go? Mm-hmm. Okay, you're going for the power. Uh, can I get up here? Yes, 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 yes. I have the feeling this is where I will uh, need to go. 
for the missing part. Now all I need to figure out is how to get the fuck up there. I was worth a try. Didn't work. Is it from like here? If there's anything, <laughs> it all looks the same. If there's any part I can climb on. I don't know which one it is. If you find something to climb on, could you tell me? I'm talking to Aloy. Okay, but honestly, at this point, if you know where I have to climb it, you can tell me too. I don't know how to get up here, but this is clearly where I have to go. Do I have to? I have to come from this side, where we're likely. This is why the rope is there. So I have to. It must be somewhere here. But everything seems a little too, too frozen to climb up on. Ugh, God, I need to stretch my leg. <laughs> Ow. Are you sure you're not? No, no, okay. Something is peeping. Probably you. No, I don't want to hear you again. I got it. Everything is in reverse. There's no way to get up here. Is it? Nope, nope. Don't talk to me. I mean, you guys work. Maybe I have to do... Wait, are you in reverse too? Or is it only... Uh, probably applies to... The others too. Okay, maybe if I start with you, you turn to the left, so you turn to the right, you turn up, so you turn down. You turn left, so you turn right. You turn down, so you turn... Wait, up, up, up is already correct. And you turn right, so you turn to the left. Uh-huh, that didn't work. Is it only because... Okay, I, I tried the right way. Like the correct way. Probably a little too easy, right? But maybe it only applies like to the other one that it's in reverse. We have to go to the right then. Done. I should check the door nearby. Ah. Okay. But what about you? I guess we come back here later. Never mind them. We should take care of this later. <laughs> oh wait, it's now later. Am I up here now? Oh, wonderful. <laughs> okay. Whoopsie. Yep, yep, yep. It's crouching. Anything else here? Ah, oh, pick up what? Found one. Looks and intact. But what do we have <laughs> over here? Then? Ah! Okay, use just some, some supply stuff. Okay, coolio. Goody, but you have to be reversed now, otherwise it makes absolutely no sense. Whatever it's just the trick. Okay. Let's get that door open. You have to go down. You have to go to the right. You have to be up. You are up. You have to be to the left. You are showing up, so you have to show down. That didn't work. Not reverse? Was it was it lying to me? Oh, I started from the wrong side. Let me... Oh, no. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Not this kind of reversed. Oh god. But wait, where does it start now? You okay, you have to be down. <laughs> it is it, it uh it was no, no, wrong okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Okay, you just have to start from the bottom. Um you have to go to the left now. You are up, this is correct. 
You have to show to the right. <laughs> All right, whatever. I did it. Uh, oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. Power. Wonderful. Now to see what lies beyond it. Woo! Oh, yeah, the axle doors appear. Mm hmm. Behind all these bodies. The dead bodies. Oh, hello. Eclipse. They're here. Avoid contact. Lines look good. Gaia. It's up there. Second floor. Can you reach it? <sighs> so much for avoiding contact. Shit, did he already see me? Wait, where is he? Oh, he can't see me. Yeah, this is a problem. Get over here! She's coming! That's not true. You're finished. Before the shadow. Ah! Ah! Mm -hmm. ah! I was healing, you son of a bitch. You don't need somebody who's just healing. I, I don't know. Oh God, there are so many. moment anyway then get moving you have to find Gaia <sighs> all right dude who doesn't risk his life down here and thinks he can tell me what to do no I don't I don't want to I don't want to do this <laughs> I, I I want his loot give me his loot and my mushrooms. My mushrooms are also always good. Hello, I'm Margot Shen, and this is Hephaestus. As the name might tip you off, this is going to be the subordinate function that Gaia will use to make lots and lots of robots. Her personal forge. Except, 
it's not that simple. Um, so like, you probably noticed that only about a third of you are robotics engineers. The rest, experts in machine cognition, virtual heuristics, that stuff. Well, that's because we aren't going to be the ones designing and building robots. The last thing we want is to burden Gaia with a bunch of outmoded 21st century designs. Waste of time. Our purpose is to empower Gaia to build the robots. And not just build, imagine, from scratch. Any robot she needs for any conceivable purpose, designed and fabricated at a snap of a finger. Hers. Her finger. So, Hephaestus isn't really the forge. It's more like the knowledge of craft and ingenuity of a mastersmith to wield the hammer. Encoded as software. Virtual creativity made real. Gaia's already learning. In simulation, she's doing some very creative things with fractal assembly and animal morphologies. Her designs aren't about to win the Liam Prize anytime soon, but hey, everyone has to start somewhere. So, yes, time to get started. Let's do this. I don't get it. Which part? It's a little technical in places. If Gaia was designed to save life, why would the robots it makes attack people? Perhaps it loves some forms of life more than others. The derangement. The machines weren't always so angry. True. Mostly they were docile until 10, 15 years ago. For years, Hephaestus has been forcing cauldrons to make aggressive machines. I've seen it myself, in the cauldrons. Stalkers, ravagers, the Thunderjaw. How could it do that? And why? Why indeed. Good question. Full steam ahead uh, from Elizabeth Sobek to Margot Sen. Subject full steam ahead. Margot, if I doubted your brilliance in the slightest, I wouldn't have picked you. As the Hephaestus Alpha. You need to stop worrying about your age and communication style. You are who you are. Have confidence in yourself. You know what you're doing. Case in point, the latest draft of your plan for the construction and stocking of bootstrap silos to store raw materials is excellent. This combined with your design for the AM Foundry Core and the Foundry Site Selection Plan add up to a comprehensive plan. It's time to start construction. One detail, consult with Ayomidi Okilo Oki, before you finalize the silo in Ventori. So fast, this first task will be fabricate the robots that will construct the waveform broadcast towers Minerva will use to transmit their deactivation code so any exotic materials needed for the tower should be accounted for in the inventory plan elizabeth Simulation results uh, from mago to elizabeth simulation results wow you weren't kidding about guys pre Dialection for animal morphology. All the science, scientist English talk. It's not my strong suit. Sure, not totally unexpected given the rough natural terrain here. Bots will have to navigate, but I agree that there is something deeper going on here. Her designs aren't just functional. They feel almost like, well, tributes is the, wor if, uh, is the word that comes to mind. As authorities are already mourning, they lost. And not just for disappearing fauna of her time, but creatures from the fossil record too. Reference to mega fauna in some of her designs, so cool. Well, whatever Gaia thinks up, her fastest will empower her to build it. I just wish we could still be around in a century or two to see what she makes. Margo. Anything else? No? Okay. I've seen these shapes before. In cauldrons. W which one is that? But of course. The birthing places of Gaia's machines. Like here? These shapes? I'm not sure which shapes he's talking about. I see only ice. Everything is ice shaped for me in here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello there. Can I? Officially, I don't see you yet. Is this her office? I can't scan it. Ah, hi. I think this is it. Elizabeth Sobek's office. But it, it's sealed off. 
There's got more eclipse. Careful now. It's scared to be a more eclipse. Oh boy. Yeah, I think at this point I can already tell no, we're not going to finish the game today. This this is once again, I don't remember this part at all, and there is so many things to explore and so many enemies popping all over the place again. So yeah. Can I shoot through here? Ah, oh, this is class. Okay, I didn't 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 notice there was class. Did you just put a bounty on there? Ages oh, or uh, do I have to go down there? Like screw you. I don't even know where to get down there to be honest. Okay, probably. Encapsulated DNA, yes. I mean her to Elizabeth encapsulated DNA and the winner is encapsulated DNA. Over the past 10 days, I performed an exhaustive review of data storage solutions. Magnetic, optical, quantum, even the even that eternity tag that of AS was a shilling a year or so ago. But every other solution has one or more failed shortcomings. Too heavy to transport, too massive to install in the allotted space, too power intensive over the centuries, too prone to fail your past 300 years, etc. Encapsulated DNA will easily hold the 40 plus setabytes we are projecting for Apollo. There are still many details to finalize, of course. To start with, we need to select the inert material in which we'll embed the molecules already testing 16 candidate materials, as well as design and fabricate the power systems and sealed relic queries that will keep the DNA at minus 18 degrees. See for a thousand plus years. So long as I assure you that it didn't factor into my decision, may it confess that the deem entirely fitting. Indeed, provisions that we will be using the very building blocks of life to persevere human knowledge from mechanized extension. It's not just ironic, but heroic. Life as a hero beating back the forces of oblivion. In any case, much to do. Until next time, peace be with you, Samina. Oh, what are you, my beauty? Holo projector. Okay. Welcome to Apollo, the collective memory of the human species and the wellspring of knowledge for future generations. I am Samina Ebaji. Until recently, I was director of the International Collective Memory Institute in New Tehran. As a heritage professional, I devoted my career to the preservation of human knowledge, creative endeavor, and cultural achievement. Apollo is, therefore, the ultimate embodiment of a lifelong passion, albeit under the very worst circumstances imaginable. The challenges before us are immense. Specifically, we will have to design and implement four major initiatives simultaneously. First, the construction of data repositories in cradle facilities around the world ensuring redundancy. Second, the collection and processing of a projected 180 million discrete data entries. 42 zettabytes of data in Mandarin, English, Spanish and Arabic. Third, the transferal and encoding of all that data onto DNA encapsulated in synthetic fossils. The only medium capacious and durable enough to safeguard it without degradation for the centuries to come. And last, but not least, the development of the holographic interface and gamified curricula, by which future humans will commune with Apollo, progressively unlocking heuristic learning modules, leveling up their knowledge and skills they will need to take control of the terraforming system. That is the future towards which all of our efforts will be directed. Not just the preservation of the past, but the seed for the flourishing of a new tree of knowledge. Welcome, and let us begin. Oh, are we looking for the next information? Apollo updates, Mina to Elizabeth. Over the past two months, the full benefit of our procurement of a copy of the Homer archive from Far Zenith has made itself known. And as a result, all of Apollo's key deliverables are on schedule. Apollo has already suppressed 40 million discrete data entries and continues to grow. Wow. 
Apologies. The vertical science modules are effectively complete with soft science modules close behind. World history, cultural data, and media archives also on schedule. Language preservation is wrapping up a bit ahead of schedule to do falling short of our goal to persevere 4,500 languages. I suppose the tragic early loss of Papua New Guinea doomed the goal from the outset. Oi. With attendant crucial development about to begin. Speaking of the horroristic Kuri Shukalar, they are performing well in testing with children and adolescents demonstrating high levels of engagement with interest in the aerosol and space here personnel. Personnel find them highly engaging, especially when you debate. I wish half my professors had been so detaining. Peace be with you, Samina. Okay. Is it time to fight again? I think it's time to fight again. <gasps> no one noticed. What? Don't you dare staying alive like that quietly. All of this lost. The ancient's greatest gift to us. Greatest? How about the fact we exist at all? To abide in ignorance is a curse, Aloy. You of all people should know that. You guys are scared to come out to play? What you talking about? Oh, hello. Wonders. Show me more of your wonders. Whoopsie. Like, like his mushrooms. My favorite wonder down here so far. E. Lutus man. Wait. E okay, this is where I have to go. Database. Somewhere here up there. Ah, uh, no. Okay, I thought I could see it. Let me go up here. Mm, there is it. What you got for me? Dr. Sobek, please archive this testimonial in Apollo. Cross-reference to all mentions of my name and Operation Enduring Victory. My name is General Aaron Harris. From 2060 to 2066, I served as the Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, the highest-ranked officer of the United States Armed Forces. The tenure of my command included strategic planning and oversight of Operation Enduring Victory a falsehood perpetrated on the civilian populations of the United States and other nations during the last 14 months of life on this planet. Before the Pharaoh Plague, I did my job and did it well. I was bold and decisive, crafty in political maneuvers. It wasn't an accident that I rose to my position and became the commander of the largest mechanized force ever assembled. But to what end? My only lasting achievement was the extinction of life on Earth. Hmm. And my one redeeming act, if any, was to delay that extinction by days or weeks, by throwing more death at it. It is my hope that there will be no need for men like me in the world to come. If you are one of the people of that future world listening to this message, please note that I am sorry and that I wish you well. Sincerely, Aaron Harris. Well, we fill it first. I see. Thank you. I 
anything else down here? Nope. Ooh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I just saw the door. Let me go. <laughs> Towards this door. Just want to make sure. No, no. Nothing else here. Okay. <laughs> door. Oh, God. There's a lot going on again. If I have to read, I should Welcome do myself before. Ah. to Hades. Oh, no, Zero not you. Dawn's extinction failsafe protocol. I had you. The ultimate killer app. Oh, wait, now, you fucked us up. I know what you're thinking. The purpose of Gaia is to resurrect life. So why give her a subordinate function, only purpose of which is to wipe out life all over again? I mean, what the... what? Just plumb crazy, ain't it? Well, no, it isn't. Reconstituting a biosphere? That's a tall order. Tech smart as Gaia may be, odds are she won't get it right the first time. I mean, imagine your Gaia 200 years from now and this new biosphere you're growing, it's all gone wrong. Alkalines are skyrocketing, coniferous forests eroding under the lash of superstorms that would have drowned Noah. It's chaos, a spinning top that won't stop wobbling. Now what are you gonna do? Release phase one organisms into that hot mess? Hope their CO2 and methane can balance out what you got started? Hell no. What you're gonna do, Gaia, is step aside while Hades takes over and does what you're just too darn nurturing and life-loving to do. Which is burn that misbegotten mess of a biosphere to the ground so Gaia can start over. Okay, not burn, more like reverse terraforming operations and suffocating. But you get the idea. Hades takes the biosphere back to zero. Square one, blank slate. And then, only then, does it hand the steering wheel back to Gaia and say, Try yes, again, do. old girl. Yeah. And better this time, or we'll have to do this again. That's Hades. It's pretty badass when you think about it. Extinction on demand. Death on speed dial. All for the greater good, of course, but still, kind of metal. <laughs> So welcome to Hades. Welcome to the Void. Okay, so... If that's the original purpose of Hades, why does it want me extinct? We need more data. Maybe it's easier as danger? How does it end up as in the threat? wreckage of a pharaoh titan, getting worshipped by the Eclipse like some kind of god? I'm learning as you are, Aloy. Keep searching. I can't remember being that annoyed by Travis doing my first playthrough. I'm pretty sure it's because my my bar, my tolerance bar for stupid male creatures just sank sank really really low low over the years. So, oh god, I can't listen to this guy anymore. Are we done with Travis now, please? A uh, good thing I have my chocolate. Noise complaints. I don't want to read anything that Travis wrote. God damn it, Elizabeth Sobek. Call me confounded, Lizzie. Bashcore, anyone who says the old TT code to Bashcore is straight up line, and you know it, old Trev don't have no track with commercialized Russell Dash, nuh uh. Even, I, I really thought it was his voice, but that was literally just the way he talks. Heck, I'd rather guzzle a little seat from run of the listen to Grace Warm for 30 seconds, hand to go ahead and swear on my mama's grave, and she was religious. Nah, no, that ain't Bowsker Blessing and had slabs, checking the walls, friendly fuck Steve, it's death metal girl, classical music, 80s and 90s mostly. Got me some Dutch death curse and jams when he's girl crying, blah, blah, just heck, come within 50 meters, oh, here, ever. I'm sorry, I'm so. I, I'm so not interested in what he's saying. <laughs> <laughs> really, I can't remember I was so annoyed by this guy. I couldn't remember him at all. The down here wasn't the first time we heard of him. This is the thing, like this one riddle. I remember this one, one, one door riddle. I don't know, maybe two or three streams ago. And this was the first time we heard about Travis because he was like like talking about this riddle, like how it is designed. And I already back then I thought it was annoying. This man is having way too much screen time. And for Doris requires to turn it down, no can do lazy, this is how it could turn down my death metal, might as well I give up simulation and blah blah code without death metal. Fuck trip. I d I'm not interested in reading anything about your music. Hate this protocol. Oh, I, I really wanted to read this because this could be actually relevant. Tate here just popped three blues, but I earned it. Finally figured out of gold the luck solution to Gary's River Extreme Executive Authority. If it ain't worth, send it 12 hours of dream time, what is it? 
Before this, every uh, patient protocol I designed felt on simulation because it was even too hard to solve. Too hard. And it degraded the Gaia core. Sure, it pried her figuratively fingers off the figurative driving wheel so Hagus could take control. But by breaking her fingers, sometimes her arms too. So that couldn't fly. Everything depends on Gaia talking, taking control back after Hades has done his business. So had to find a solution that didn't leave Gaia any worse for the wear. Too soft and Gaia only pretended to relinquish control. In simulation after simulation, Hades would take command of the terraforming system and reverse operations, only to have Gaia lurk in the background, quietly reversing processes and fa falsely fying telemetry to hide the interference. Sneaky. I swear I ain't nothing Gaia wouldn't do keep it life going, even when it's just simulated plant life. Turns out the just right solution is to isolate Gaia in a protective coat shell. Persevering its integrity, then unseated from command, positioned to Hades can slip into the figuratively captain's chair and work its magic. Um, the blues are coming on strong now, so I'm not really describing, it's good clear, but pretty sure it will work. Yeah, those blues are plenty strong, cause it's time to sleep at bed, I'll, I'll back to tomorrow, alligators. I hate Travis. Solution is to isolate Gaia in a protective coat shell, persevering its integrity, then unseated from command position so Hades can slip into the figurative captain's chair and work its magic. And that sounds actually relevant. We're here. Archive abuse. Ooh, yeah, I would like to know what happens to the archive. From Samina to Trevor, CC Elizabeth, Mr. Tate. This mech concerns a parlor archive submission number 0023876. Your 666 submission in just five days, and oh, what a doozy. Despite earlier warnings, three inappropriate material to choose to submit 265 holographic remarks of acknowledged class of extreme exploitation cinema. Oh, he's into porn. Ha <laughs> ha, it's so funny. I hate this guy. Allow me then to thank you on two counts. First, for giving me the pleasure of rejecting your submission. Thereby consigning your favorite Eastern European torture flicks and their ill to the dust heap of oblivion. It truly warms my heart to know that I have saved future humanity from the ordeal of experiencing not just one but all 16 installments of making a millipede. Don't worry, the Pasolini material has already been persevered, extreme perhaps, but ours. Second, for clarifying a concept that has no long been ambiguous and ethically fraught for archivists such as myself, the definition of obscenity. You have freed me from the subjective quimera embodied in Judge Potter's famous utterance, I know it when I see it. Thanks to you, I now apply a single objective criterion. If Trevor Tate submitted, it's obscene. Ah, oh, good. Accordingly, I have directed Apollo staff to similarly reject all of your future submissions side on seat. I love this lady. Perhaps you might invest the time you would have spent preparing future submissions on, oh, I don't know, your assigned work? We have a word to save after all. All the rest of us do anyway. Damn! Tell him, queen! Who of you was it? Samina! At one point I thought you were talking a lot when we talked about you, Aria, but only because you actually were passionate about it. After reading him like this, you my queen. I like you. Fuck Trev. <laughs> I'm waiting and rested! This is actually really good, like I'm totally on her side, I really hate this guy. These are like some, some random side characters as soon as I'm out of here, we'll never hear about him again. They died who knows how long ago here in this game, and yet I'm really invested. This is good writing. Whoever wrote Trevor's... Good writer, you make him really the most hateful, ha easy to be hated person in the whole game. Damn, I just I just realized that this is good writing. Looks like the only <laughs> way onwards. Oh god, I'm tired. Are we done yet? <laughs> Welcome to Eleuthia, the <laughs> crown up. and king of Gaia's subordinate functions. For it is by Eleuthia that the human race will continue to exist. I am Patrick Brochard Klein, the Alpha in charge of this program. Now let one thing be perfectly clear from the outset. Eleuthia is not a genetic engineering project. Our goal is to preserve the human genome, not alter it. A snapshot of human genetic diversity, literally frozen in time. The genetic quintessence of our species, unmodified. 
under my watch our activities and initiatives will comply with the 2034 clone provisions and the 2048 rally accords now that may seem a quaint even trivial concern to you in light of present circumstances but as one of the authors of the accords it is far from trivial to me the practical challenges before us are staggering in scope and complexity but not insurmountable no global collation and provisional storage of zygotes perfection of exogenic technologies design and perfection of servitors to provide nurture and inculcation during early child development all of these program components must and will proceed in tandem to say nothing of the breakneck construction of cradle facilities at sites around the world. So, si vous êtes prêt, let us begin. Roger. F set. Chambers, and once again, I was so quick. <laughs> Patrick to Elizabeth F. Sarah Chambers, the Echogenic Chambers arrived two days ago. We spent the last 36 hours examining them and poring over technical documentation. They're a revelation. Astonishing. I don't know what you had to give for Zenith and Trey to get these chambers, but it was worth it. In a single leap, they're in Bryolology juice. Sorry. Have faulted past 50 years of technological shortcomings. The risk of ECMO resolved. Nutrition delivery resolved. Hormonal stability resolved. 12 other risk carriers resolved. Before I examine these chambers, I consider the Odyssey to be a fool's errand. To be a fool's errand? But if the rest of the asset technology is at this level, well, a human a colony around Sirius doesn't seem too impossible after all. Mass application of the chambers will present a number of challenges, but I'm confident it can be resolved. I'm going to rest for a few hours, then get back to it. Expect the fabrication plan within 48 hours. PBK. Jump. Are these what I what I think they are? Artificial wombs. Machines to spawn a new generation of human beings. Oh, okay. That was the end of the conversation. Uh what cradle? Cradle Severe Personier Patrick to Elizabeth. Development of the artificial personier of Cradle Servitors. Nurture, disciplinarian, healer continues at a good pace. We are targeting turning 0.4 for these constructs. They should allow low-grade empathy and limited improvisation without undermining adherence to codified behavior sets. The stimulus, drive and switching of a person here, however, is proving to be a greater software challenge than anticipated, especially concerning our entrenched feedback loops between the disciplinarian and healer person here. I have also attached the reports from an incident where a servitor running the mother person here intervened on a disciplinarian servitor's behavior. A parental argument, if you will. Amusing on first glance, perhaps, but deeply concerning. I have attached a comprehensive plan for correcting these interactive protocol shortcomings in just data corrupted. Let me loot first. What do you got for me? Cradle sealed. Patrick to Elizabeth. Eloy Theor? Zero one. Was successfully sealed before the swan adver advancing across Xinjiang province could detect it. Ping back from crucial system is good for our maiden voyage is success. Regards my disputes with the betas over Saigat selection. Of course, I understand we have limited overheat to run simul simulations of gene flow in our future humans. But we can all agree there is a margin for refinement in future cradle populations. Dank, in addition to personally overseeing completion of the Olithia 02 inside Mount Namuli, I will formulate and propose a modified Saigat selection plan within a week. PBK. Okay, got it for this area. Cradle facilities. Let me move on. 
Elizabeth said a, a new generation of humans would be spawned inside such places. She did. All Mother Mountain. It was one of them? There's only one way to be sure. It makes a lot of sense. The hatch but... wouldn't open. Something, something about a corrupted alpha registry. I need to search Elizabeth's office. We're on our way. It's been an awful long time since I encountered the last enemies, but so, enemies, but so far we're doing fine. I'm very happy about it. Used to hold something. Would benefit from antilomine morphology. Though Capric form shows superior load bearing capability. You're a quick study, Gaia. Doctor Sobek, as I have conducted this comparative analysis of mammalian morphologies, I've gathered extensive data on the Quaternary Extinction Event. Oh. And your assessment? Gaia? Logically speaking, the extinction was a natural consequence. And yet... And yet... I find the loss of megafaunal species... unaccountably sad. That they passed forever into oblivion... causes me to experience... a grief... that is difficult to describe. Is this Am I malfunctioning? Do you feel that? No, no, Gaia, you're not. This is good. It's very good. Okay, so you're supposed to have emotions like that. Makes sense. I, I think, I'm not sure. Uh, what do you have for me? Gaia Lock? You will undergo a brief period of unconsciousness during relocation to Prime and final statement. Elizabeth, may I speak outside protocol? When you're back up and running at the new site, we'll bring the subordinate functions online and see where we stand. Elizabeth, I detect distress. <laughs> Are you all right? I'm <laughs> fine. <laughs> I realize that circumstances compel us to launch earlier than we hoped, but all subsystems are operational. The odds stand in our favor. But what if... Gaia, there's nothing left out there. You can't even survive unless you're wearing an environmental suit. There are billions dead. In fear and agony. What if... What if it was all for nothing? Elizabeth, extinction was inevitable. Thanks to you, life will have a future. You really believe that? I believe in you, Elizabeth. In you? The loudest neighbor is moving some very loudest furniture, killing the mood. Guys, once again, I got a little goosebumps. This is all very well done here. Mm, oh, there we go. Pure logic won't cut it, Ted. To pull this off, Gaia's going to need to have some skin in the game. It has to care. What if it runs amok? Have we learned nothing from our mistakes? Your mistakes, I think you mean? All I'm saying is give it a kill switch. She was just born, Ted. I'm not gonna put a gun to her head while she's still in the cradle. You talk like it's a child. What if it becomes a monster? Elizabeth, may I speak outside protocol? <sighs> of course, Gaia, go on. I'm sorry to contradict you, but Mr. Pharaoh's argument is sound. At this point, the development of my psyche is not entirely predictable. To ensure yes. preservation of life, a hardwired override is, I believe, a necessary safeguard. There. Satisfied, Ted? Jeez, let's just do what it says. So there is a kill switch? Christian Mark? Find the entrance. Uh, gear? Okay, this this is this is the office office. This looks like a door. This is a door. For everyone who was questioning, guys, this is a door. Odyssey has failed. Elizabeth to all alphas. All. Some terrible news, I'm afraid. First, Senef has informed me that the Odyssey mission has failed. Last night, Telemetry indicated a catastrophic antimatter containment failure as they thrive spun up to depart the solar system. 
the ship, its crew, its cargo of saggots and seeds, its alpha build of Apollo. All were lost. Zeradon is now the only hope for the continuation of the human species and earthly life. We must succeed, Elizabeth. Okay, but the alpha version of Apollo. Like, there is there's still is supposed Probably to be an archive somewhere. Okay, I wanna there is something else to scan first. I I, I don't wanna I don't wanna touch you. No no, no access, no access. <laughs> Not before I got any other information here. Artemis Staters, Charles to Elizabeth. Artemis Staters. It's coming along, at least. I'm positive about it. If this words can still mean anything. Half my sleeves rolled up, negotiating with frozen Zeus. For example, so many species trapped in ghoulish hologram diorams suspended in what ifs. More than 14,000 that went extinct between 2000 and 2043. We started mapping out primary succession, selecting the pioneer organism for a balanced and sustainable biosphere. Microorganisms and insects, rabbits and hawks, foxes and wolves. Thousands more that will have to wait a turn until our new generation can be entrusted with the duty of restoring them, so that they can return to a world that, this time, will understand the concept of conservation before it's too late. There's already been too many too late. We lost a whole collection team during the swamp breakthrough in Mayan Mayanama? May Mayanama? The samples we lost were, well, irreplaceable. But thanks to you, at least the circle of life will bend, not break. The earth was, life the earth was a lifeless rock before, and someday it will be again, but not now. Not like this. Not on our watch. Ransom. Okay. I think that was all on extra information we had. The Alpha Registry Master File. Intact? Yeah. No signs of corruption. Then what are you waiting for? Copy the file. With this, I can restore the registry at the hatch inside All Mother. Open it. Go inside. And grasp the secrets within. Where I was born. Maybe. Maybe who gave birth to me. Who? Are you really so naive? There will be no who waiting for you there, Aloy. Whatever birthed you into the world was a what, not a who. You bastard. Oh no, I had a legitimate birth. It's you, Aloy, who are the creation of a machine. Cute! But Fuck what you! what kind of machine and why? Why were you created? You can still be a best dad, though. Just saying. Ah! <laughs> it looked like spiders coming down. You need to get out of there. What you found is too valuable. You're too valuable. We got it. Um. Suitable death in mind for you, child. <laughs> that was unexpected. Uh, I have a My bad entire feeling. life, uh -oh. I've always known one thing with prophetic certainty: that I was destined for glory as a great champion of the sun. Even when Joran was murdered, even when Meridian fell, I never doubted my destiny. Until you came along. When I heard that you had survived, a doubt took root in my mind. As sure as the sun rises and falls each day, those I am bade to kill die. And yet I failed. How? Why? With each dig site you attacked, each loyal soldier you killed, this pestering doubt grew. It grew when High Priest Bahavas went missing, and when the true Sun King Itamin was snatched away. It not only grew, but multiplied. I kept thinking of the moment my knife pierced your throat. 
One twist. A simple tug of the blade, and you would have bled out. In slaughter, I am a practiced hand. So why hesitate? Why fail my destined purpose? I'm pretty sure you're going to die. <laughs> well, this is this is a question you already have an answer for. You knew it was wrong. Try it. <laughs> I'm sorry, but if you're gonna go on babbling like this all night, could you just kill me now? Oh no, we're in no hurry, you and I. Damn it. Not now. Who really is going to maybe some to physical torture to distract me from your voice? At that moment, she on the sounds mountain, so much like Chloe when she's like that. I, I aim to kill you with dispatch. And yet did not. Why? This failing troubled my thoughts. I see you don't have an answer. Haunted every step. It was only when I captured you down. So you have an place, answer. That I finally glimpsed the sun's design etched at length across the course of events. You were meant to survive that day on the mountain. Meant to interfere at dig sites and kill my men. Meant to eliminate High Priest Bahavas. Sure. Meant to snatch Itaman away. Yeah. Conversely, I was meant to capture you. Here. So that you might die as a sacrificial offering to the sun. <sighs> Everything as it was meant to be. Predestined and preordained. Uh, Popper, it sounds good. Some destiny. You're following orders, not some grand cosmic design. You're a puppet, with Hades yanking the strings, a pawn pushed around by larger forces. It'd be laughable if there weren't so much killing involved. Hades is an ancient machine, not the buried shadow of Karja myth. It doesn't care about Meridian. It wants to kill everything and everyone. It looks like and he's you nodding. Are its dutiful slave. I serve not the buried shadow, but the sun in shadow. All halves of nature joined to one cause. Shadow to sun, dark to light. Do you really not hear how ridiculous that sounds? You've gone from serving an insane homicidal Sun King to an insane homicidal machine. You're moving down in the world, not up. Damn. I'll remember those words as I watch your corpse burn. Whatever's left of it. Because you know I'm right. You fail to grasp the point. As surely as you've been conquered, so has all doubt. And with certainty of belief comes unstoppable force. Then open this cage and put your faith to the test. See if things work out like you expect. The circle has closed. Every element is in its proper place, exactly where it belongs. The errant beast, now caged, will serve her true purpose. A sacrificial animal. Oh, speaking of sacrifice, I forgot to tell you. Mm -hmm. After you crash the Eclipse Network, I sent messengers into the east to rally the forces there and mount an invasion of the sacred land. I ordered every Nora killed. I was hoping to catch you there, but alas, it all seems to have been unnecessary. <laughs> that curse me out! I mean, there are some lies of them, but overall they're so... The Nora cast me out at birth. You're not hurting me if you hurt them. Really? Then it makes no difference one way or another. In any case, I couldn't recall the order even if I wished to. Thanks to your destruction of the network, communication over distances is impossible. God, that sounds like a horrible You not only doomed thing. yourself, but an entire tribe. Do we not see the scorching judgment of the sun in these events? Your focus. Such a powerful device, isn't it? And yet, so fragile. Just like you think. 
<sighs> so you see, this time, I did not hesitate. You hesitated for like 10 minutes the of knife monologue, boy. Has already been twisted. Oh god, you're such an idiot. <laughs> I don't remember what's happening, but it's not going to be fun. Wait, wait, yeah, wait, you all have beef, beef with me. You're all weird. Weird people. What am I going to fight? I'm scared. Karja Faithful, rejoice! Our years in shadow are over. A new dawn trembles on the horizon. A new day, soon to break. And when it does, the false Sun King will be dead, and Holy Meridian ours once more. In this, I have become an instrument of prophecy. All halves of nature join to one cause. Shadow to sun, light to dark, night to day. Behold! You're me. I have nothing! Hold your seats! Can you not see the proof of the sun's blessing before your eyes? How else? Such as these prowl in broad yeah, 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 yeah. light of day. I, I, Jesus, you were Would so much more intimidating when you weren't talking. Like back then, I'm out to our cause. Many years ago, to consecrate this great ring, the radiant Turan ordered many faithless crushed beneath the hooves of the behemoth. Mighty is the behemoth in the eye of the sun. But it is mightier oh, sorry, still, him. infused with the power of shadow. Let this one, who schemed and slithered, be the first I to die. I still have no weapons, though, so, so I don't know how much better that is. be the first of thousands! It is more important than listening to him. Okay, how do we do this? I have flowers. Oh god, wait, I'm flying against everyone here? I thought only... God, girl, we have a rough day. <laughs> I'll never beat that thing without weapons. My weapons are up on the platform. There's no way out of this ring. Maybe I could use its strength against it. What can we use against? Oh, okay, wait. That pillar's weak. Another hit, and that pillar will come down. Uh, okay. Oh no, I didn't want to whistle! Are we, are we going for the other one again? She said one more. Uh, uh, okay, one more of these pillars here. Okay. Uh oh! It's down. Is everything falling apart now? That's fun. Oh no, it's just my weapons! I really thought like like everything was falling apart and we could just leave. <laughs> no, we still have to fight. Am I coming out of this cloud now with my armor on and my weapon? <laughs> because it only took like 10 seconds to get Trice. What? You guys have said I have a fair chance? No hey, way! Fuck you! Guess you got a weapon back. Now you're just a big dumb target. Come and get it. What is, does he not like? What? I, I would like to. Oh no, I don't. Oh, I don't have my focus anymore because he crushed it. I, I, I just hope you don't like fire. No one likes fire, right? Oh, shit! I pressed the wrong thing again to roll away. Components on the sides of its head. They've got something to do with this lift attack. That canister on its belly looks important. I can't 
Chelsea. Fight. Is it is it over yet? No, he wants me dead. Yep, he's surprised I'm still alive. Okay, so I a little, honestly. Silence. No. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I was 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 right up. Shadows, kill her. Oh shit! I'm so fucked. Like fire either, right? No one likes fire. Kill her! Why leave it to them? Come get me yourself! No! What is okay, I don't have to kill them? What is happening here? Sounds like a horse. We don't have horses here. Ah, we have Oh! Someone is actually shelling himself! Well, you wanted someone getting sacrificed, but that was so much cooler, right? You're just a little rat head dying within five seconds because there's no weapons. That was much more fun as a spectator. So I was you're spectating here. a lot, so yeah. Really here? You risked your life. Of course I did. If you'd been killed, the Nora's sacred mountain Yay. would never have given up its secrets. Too bad you wasted your time then. Helis destroyed my focus and the Alpha Registry with it. Not at all. The whole time I've been monitoring your focus, I've duplicated every data file you scanned. Installing that data to a new focus was trivially easy. Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. You're really good at making it impossible to like you, Silence. Mm -hmm. But I guess I need this. It's time to see where you were born. Maybe you'll even learn why. Yeah. Meet the machine that birthed me into this world. Isn't that how you put it? I'll be off. Wait. Yes? How did you find me? How did you track my location when I wasn't wearing a I focus? I mean, you could have figured I was here, right? Really, Aloy. It doesn't take a genius to surmise that Helis would throw you into the sun ring at high noon. Fair. I wore out two striders getting here in time, but I did. Now be on your way. Ah, I'm not done. Since when can you override machines? Ever since you discovered the technique. I had to destroy a corrupter to obtain the necessary parts, of course. But your example showed me how to do that as well. Yet another benefit of monitoring your activities through your focus. Truth be told, the underlying logic of the technique isn't so different from rites practiced by Banuk shamans. Though, of course, far more advanced. Great. You're welcome, I guess. Helis recognized you back in the Sunring. You told me that you'd assisted the Eclipse. Not that you knew the man who killed my... Who almost killed me. So now you know. The man is a serious threat. So let's do all we can to make sure that he and Hades don't succeed. Right. Fair enough. I'll be on my way. To make matters worse... Helis ordered an Eclipse detachment to attack the Nora Sacred Land. The tribe's already weak. They won't stand a chance. You should come with me. Well, absolutely not. <laughs> I have preparations to make elsewhere. What kind of... Why do I bother asking? You're not gonna tell me. You're learning. When the time is right, I'll be in touch. Uh -huh. I'll contact you later. Mm -hmm. In the meantime, should you need to return to Shadow Karja territory, I brought armor to conceal your identity. 
You think of everything, don't you? One of us has to. Aloy, when you were recovering the Alpha Registry down in the Zero Dawn bunker, I was needlessly cruel. Daddy, where for is your it? Sake, I hope there is someone waiting there for you inside the mountain. Not a what, but a who. Oh. This is the first time ever he's yeah. acting like a human being since we know him. Um, this is broken. Damn wind. Never cared for being pushed around. <laughs> really? After all which she's been through, the first thing you have to do is complaining about the weather once again. Okay, um, I think... Oh god. There, there was a fire nearby, one I did, haven't even discovered yet, let me go over here. Uh, Werewolf King, if you're still around, would you mind telling me... I should take a break here, right? I, I'm, I'm playing with the idea to finish it now, but even I'm starting to remember that there are still a few things ahead of me. At least two hours, right? At least two hours, if not more. More like three hours, could it be? I mean, I could handle two hours, but my, my intuition is like, now nah, more like two and a half to three hours, what I have left. Especially when I still also want to go get the armor back, like down there, this is still something I have. No, there are three missions and what is almost as long as this one here. Okay, never mind then. Did someone yell at me? <laughs> so, someone, was someone yelling here at me? Okay, in that case... I, I slightly, it's slightly starting, like the whole part we just played, like the last one and a half hours or something I had no memory about. When I was in this, in this cage again, I started to remember, ah, okay, but also I didn't, I, I, it is incredible how much I forgot about this game. Not because I, I it's just very, it's was just a big game with a lot of information. Um, and it's a few years ago, so I just forgot about it a lot. Okay, um, I can, I, I wanted to go for you, I don't know what I want next, I just saved my points. I was safe and call it a day, and hopefully <laughs> we will finish it next Next week then. I think again I, I um checked my wait, let me what what do we have today? Yeah, this should be fine. I checked the playlist of my old let's play of my old German let's play of this game from a few years ago, and I'm pretty sure next week we should be able to finish the main game if I play a little longer than like if I'm more like going for five hours, which is still be fine. Um but I think yeah, you should be able to finish next week exactly. Um Maybe like like three, four hours, if, 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 if the longest five hours, but then I really should be should be there. So yeah, um, next week the end.